coming at you live from YB Recording. It's The Edge with Joe and Alex. Good evening. It's a beautiful Monday evening. We're here at YME Recording Studios. Yes, it um, is. I'm Joe, and this guy is... Uh, Alex. All right, and we're here tonight in the hallowed halls of uh, YME Recording. Yes. With the fabulous Joe DeLuca. And we have a guest of a lifetime. Yes, actually, we have a oh. great guest. We have a great guest and a great friend here with her. Yes. So um, I'm not going to hold it back anymore. Guess who's here? The fabulous, the wonderful, the talented... The cute, the pretty, Miss Maggie Gabbard. Yes. Welcome Maggie. to the show, guys. How are you? And introduce our, our friend. Introduce our, our friend. Our <laughs> great friend, not only uh, in my personal <clears throat> life, but also to the show. Don't get personal. <laughs> and uh, actually uh, produced uh, Maggie for I don't know how many years now. Uh, our great friend, Mr. Richie Rubini. How are you, sir? Happy to be here. It's very good to have both of you guys back. Definitely. Yes. It's um, I, you guys, well, you guys have always helped us out. You, you were like one of our first shows at the other yeah. place. Yeah. The first, yeah. The, the, the very, very first, first show, show okay. we've ever done. Get out! Isn't that awesome, yeah. Maggie? I yep. know. Yeah. And we always love having Which her back. Cool. Absolutely. She's amazing. She oh, is. She's uh, thanks, her voice guys. is unbelievable. Definitely. Yeah. How you been? Wonderful. 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 Just working, recording, writing. You have something very nice that just came out, right? I do. Mm-hmm. What is the name of this item? Luminosity. Um, it's my new record. Just released on August 14th. So be sure to check that out. Yeah. Go check it out. We're going to make sure we get everybody to know where you can get the album at, where you can buy it, where you can listen yes. to it, every place you can see it. That's all coming very soon. Yeah, we're going to be playing a lot of tracks off of this. Well, first of all, how was your summer? What did you do? We did a lot of crazy stuff. We talked about that <laughs> last show. Uh, well, what did you do? What did Maggie Gabbard do? This summer. Wow. It seems like it was forever ago when it just ended, right? Yeah. It's, oh my God. This summer. Um, I mean, really, I was working on recording on my record. Um, mm-hmm. I've just been, like I said, writing and recording with people, getting all this in place. And then we just released it August 14th. So that's really what my summers consisted of. Oh, absolutely. That was a great Cedar release party, by the way. Thank you. I was so fortunate Thank you. my wife attended. I know. I'm so happy you could be there. We, we kind of had a feeler out there and said, you know what? We're just going to clear our schedule because this is a big day. Oh, to, I appreciate some, it. Thank you. Somebody means not just a lot to us here at the show, but personally, just knowing Richie and having met you guys and obviously being the, our first guest, we had to definitely represent. And uh, you, it was cool, you, you killed it. You Thank killed you it so much. Night. Thank no you. No doubt about it. No doubt about it. Definitely, I definitely um, would um, just listen to the material off this new album. I see nothing but very big and good things coming for you. Thank you. Really, you um, like I told you, I told you before, your voice just amazing, mm. amazing. Uh, who do you have? Uh, let me get right into it. Who do you have working on this uh, CD? Like, kind of fill in the blanks. Um, I worked with. Let's see. The first one is Shine, which I'll be. Um, singing live tonight. Worked with Tony Reyes on that one. Um, Lauren Hart, Richie, of course. Um, Justin Tracy, Ian Walsh. Mm-hmm. Am I missing anyone? RKVC boys. RKVC. Oh my God! How could I forget them? Yeah, of right. course. Um, yeah, Rod and Vince, and that's that. Excellent, excellent. Mm-hmm. And recorded at different places or? Yeah, different places. I mean, depending on who I was working with. Sure. Yeah. Now, how do you think that works like with uh, you guys just moving all over the place? Uh, what, does it, do you think it'd get together something better or do you think it would have been more solid being at one place the whole time? I mean, I think for, for what it is, it was perfect, you know? Mm-hmm. One day we'll get it all in one. But spot. It just, I mean, it just seems like that's that's how it rolls out. Exactly. These days. I mean, it is. Um, Especially when you're working with, when she's working with different producers and things like that, you know, they're going to work in their situation mm-hmm. that they're, they're, their comfort zone, their comfort zone sure. and it's cool. That's the way it should be, you mm-hmm. know, and Maggie gets to break out a little bit and so it's cool. Yeah, I got to tell you the, the actual physical, r- rare to say that these days, I was about to say <laughs> the physical, no, you like stopped yourself. touching <laughs> feeling of a CD, the package itself. You're not supposed to be touching it. Is amazing. <laughs> well, I, I do like to look. I'm, I'm old school. I like to. Oh, I, I thought like, you were talking about yourself, not the album. Oh, okay. so, well, <laughs> that's a whole nother show and more of a documentary, <laughs> but uh, the package is great. The artwork is amazing. And you really bless us with a great um, 
poster. Uh, tell us a little bit. We kind of got into that. That was actually done at the Queen also? At the Queen, uh-huh. Great shot, great Thank shot. You. And actually resonates, uh, another shot of it resonates right on the back of the uh, CD. Yes. Uh, who took the shots? Who's the photographer behind this? Oh, my God. Haley Cairo. Yeah. Yes. Um, she actually lives around me. That's how we know her. But, uh -huh. yeah, she's awesome. She captured yeah. you. Mm -hmm. she, she's done a couple shoots with Maggie, and Maggie had this idea that she wanted to kind of go um, quasi-Egyptian-y a little bit. Yeah. yeah. You know, and hence the... The gold skirt. Mm -hmm. That and... and um, I can't do a gold skirt. I tried. It, no, silver, right? Yeah, I sell oh, Only did. silver. Well, <laughs> <laughs> uh, but uh, so Maggie kind of came up with the cover concept with the crystal pyramid and all that kind of stuff. Excellent. And, great, great, great sight. I well, mean, it, it sells. It sells. The picture sells it. It pops. It jumps out. The poster is just nothing short of a breathtaking shot. Mm -hmm. Behind that distress wall, I mean, it just... It jumps out. It Behind the distressed walls. Good. Right. Yeah, but it's got that whole it's got the look. aged thing going Definitely. on. And I'm it definitely about aged. that. No <laughs> doubt about it. I want to hear one of her songs. Can we at least get to that? You can stop rambling. And we got to dive into it. I think we're going to hear the uh, fourth track off the uh, CD. Uh, the Reason is Here. Tell us a little bit about that. Um, this is a song. Actually, Rich and I kind of came up with the concept behind it. And then we got Ian Walsh, um, mm -hmm. who... Put a little magic into it. So it's an interesting. Um, we we had this track, and so we had to finish the song. And uh, you remember Ian? It, yep. uh, for, you know yep. his, his band Bel Air. They're signed to RCA now. Their record's mm -hmm. going to come out next year. Super. Uh, and Ian's doing a lot of producing and things like that. But he, um, I just contacted him. We had coffee, and I said, "Hey, dude, uh, you want to do some? Would you like to do a remix <clears throat> off of something that you know could be on you know on Maggie's record?" And so I went through the tracks, and he would say, I want to do that one. And then we got to, then, then I played him another one. He's like, oh, no, I think I want to do that one. And then we got to the song, which ours was called The Reason. And he said, no, I want to do that one. I said, okay, <laughs> dude. So then he calls me a week later, so I send him all the stems. Uh -huh. And he's like, I want to rewrite the chorus. I said, okay, if I rewrite the chorus. I was like, hmm. Okay, I guess that's what these kids do, and that's called a remix. You know, I mean, I know yeah, about right. it, but I just thought, okay, there's, you know, because it is, there's a, it's, sure. you go a lot of different ways. Anyway, so I said, uh, okay, sure, dude. So he actually just took stuff that, it, it's a true collaboration. I cut stuff mm -hmm. at my place, um, which he kept, uh, vocal stuff, and then he, he recut the chorus vocals and all, did all stuff and put a wholly different track underneath it. So... That is the reason it's here. And it's actually the track that has been getting a lot of bit written up on all these blog sites, these hit blog that. sites and all this kind of stuff. So, uh, but so just really a crazy kind of scenario. Now we still have our proper song, which we're going to release as a different version sure. yeah. uh, somewhere down the road as another B side or something. But um, mm -hmm. it's really funny how it all kind of, cool. Ian, Ian killed it. So. Yeah. Uh, no doubt. No doubt. Kudos. Well, I'm definitely looking forward to dive into it. Here's a great track off the great new album by Maggie Gabbard. Luminosity, here's track number four off of that called The Reason Is Here. When you think too hard is when it don't flow tight. Pray to God, kiss the moon, hope my soul grow right. Ain't never gonna get
Welcome back to The Edge. I'm Joe, and this is Alex. We're here with the beautiful and talented Maggie Gabbard. Yes. And um, that was her first song. Yeah, what was that called again? That was called The Reason Is Here, and I'll tell you what. It puts it on a map. <laughs> definitely. And so, no, I mean, I, I told, no I told her it. during the break, it makes, me, it makes you feel like you're kind of like floating. Yep. It's just a, we got a really <laughs> like nice it. beat to it. Everything's just Great right flow. there. Your voice is a killer on that. But I, Thanks, I always guys. tell you that. I mean, it's, I, I just see... Uh, Big things for you, I really do. I really Thank do. You, I, you deserve it. Both of you do. I'll tell you what, after, after hearing this track, Joe, uh, <clears throat> it takes me back to that CD release. And I got to mention, I mean, from the first time we interviewed Maggie to where you are today, good grief, have you come a long way? Not just <laughs> in your in oh, yeah. music. And she's only 19. Yeah. You're but that's why I just presence. said I said to Richie, too, when I mean, we first came in. I said, man, she's uh, just just everything about her is just a, it's a... There's been a drastic change in you from the first time we met you to now. Well, good. I'm glad and, you guys... I mean, it's all a really good yeah, change. Thanks. You know what I mean? You, you just, uh, you're a lot more mature and you're even, you look more, even more like you're ready to just go. You know what I mean? So that's what... It's a good thing. Awesome you're, thing. You're, yeah. Awesome thing. You're comforting in your yeah. zone. Yeah. You're, you're, you're sound. And what I was about to say is <clears throat> when we uh, went to your CD release party, um, your stage presence, mm -hmm. there's a whole difference you have that you just look out to the crowd and they're just yeah. basically looking at you wanting more out of you and mm -hmm. you're just delivering it right there on the play for them. And it, it was just, it was really great. Uh, I Thank was, you. I think sitting there with our guest from a uh, couple of weeks ago, Nick Ebert. And uh, we just were like, wow, this is just what it's, what music's about coming out. Nice, mm -hmm. fresh, great new sound. Um, killing it, killing it. And I'll tell you what, the CD, you're going to hear a lot of it tonight. Um, yeah. You're gonna bless us with a couple great tracks uh, in the studio, but I'll tell you what, you have to run out and get this CD immediately. Start downloading it. If you're old school like me, you want to get the physical CD. It is available also, <laughs> so it's great. Absolutely is. Um, but Al, we got to talk about one thing real quick before we go any further. Yes, we're gonna do our sponsor, one of our sponsors here. Yeah. Um, who makes the best coffee around here? Um, well, we have the barista of the place that does. Well, yeah, but I mean, where does he work? Where does, you know, where does he, can, can he be found? Coffee works too. That's it. Absolutely. If you, if they're the official coffee of the edge. Yes. Well, awesome. You guys realize that, Maggie? The official no, coffee No, I did not realize edge. that. I do now. Absolutely. So if you guys out there want some excellent food, great coffee, weekly entertainment, mm -hmm. they're located in the Ritz Movie Theater in Voorhees, New Jersey. Awesome. Yep. Stop on out there and see them. Stop out and say hi. I know Joe and Alex from the edge sent you. You got it. Bother a guy called Stop over there, Maggie. Joe the I know, barista. right? <laughs> Yeah, that's uh, what I want to say. When, you, when, when you're going out and playing these shows, right, <clears throat> what is your, um, how does it feel with the, with the, with the audience, like, get, giving you such a good feedback? I mean, uh, how does that, to, like, to you just as, yeah. as a person? Yeah, I mean, that always makes it better. You know yeah. what I mean? I mean, if, if I see people enjoying it, that just makes me mm -hmm. feel more Singing comfortable. Singing your words. I mean, yeah. that, that's what's, uh, that's got to be such a cool feeling. I oh, mean. yeah. Mm -hmm. right. Actually, I just had a show at um, Pianos in Manhattan, and... It was my first time actually being in New York and playing. But um, at one point, it was funny because I was there, like, not laughing, but, like, it makes you happy. There were, like, um, a couple people started, like, getting up and just, like, dancing. And yeah. I was like, okay. <laughs> no, cool. but it's good, like, to see people, like, reacting to your music well, and you enjoying feed, it. You feed off of that. Yeah, exactly. You feed off of it. Love exactly. It. Yeah. yeah. It's no, definitely, it's definitely a good feeling. Well, I'll tell you what, speaking of which, we just want to slam this CD right in front of everybody's front and center, as mm -hmm. we say. Let's get right to it. Uh, tell us a little bit about uh, the track we're about here, uh, Freak Show. Freak Show, actually, um, that was one that I did with Tony, Tony Rice, and mm -hmm. I just released a video, actually. You can find it on YouTube. Um, just YouTube Freak Show Maggie Gabbard, and it'll pop up. When do, when do we release that? Uh, about a month ago. About a month ago, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So be sure to check that out, but um, yeah. It's a kind of a cool video. Yeah. Very cool, very cool. It's probably one of my, like, weirder songs. Not weird, but I don't know. Listen to it. It's, <laughs> it's, it's deep, interesting, and good all at the yeah. same time. Yeah, which, which is, I'll tell you what, something great. Well, there's another great track, Freak Show, off of her newest release, Luminosity. Freak Show. I know of a place Full of curiosity 
Sight's hard to explain Like a twisted fantasy So don't close your eyes You don't wanna miss a thing Here's your ticket in Step right up and come with me Don't say that I didn't warn you You already know Whatever turns you on Nothing's right and nothing's wrong Rips and stains Your curiosity Sometimes love is strange Such a twisted fantasy Just don't close your eyes You don't wanna miss a thing Here's your ticket in Step right up and come with me Welcome back to The Edge. This is Joe. We're back here with the fabulous Maggie Gabbard and Richie Rubin. I can't find Alex anywhere. He seemed to have disappeared on me. Um, he ran away. Hey, in the Alex. Middle. Well, do you, know, you, do, you know why, do you know why I think he left? Because the last song that was played, it was very dreamy. Oh. And he like, faded away. I thought you were going to say it scared him away. No. Now, Either way. I'm telling you what. I, 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 even today when I was listening to your stuff, I, I think this this album is like, like how you were saying like with the Egyptian feel or whatever. Mm-hmm. It it's very like um, I I don't know. It's just the, the whole album to me is just like it's it, it's very. I keep saying like you dreamy. Say dreamy. I, I like, yeah, I like I, that. I, I, though. Yeah, but I, I don't that's I don't cool. know whether I'm. No, no. If you she, get what I'm saying, that's because she's kind of into trippy stuff. <clears throat> because mm-hmm. it just um, she's into that kind it just seems very very like it, it puts you at ease. Yeah, Do you know cool. I, and that's what's cool. Yeah, I mean, it's awesome. it, it just sounds like the, it's right there. You know, it's definitely right Go there. Ahead. I you know I love you. That's the best coffee. You know where I was not just getting coffee or helping Joe. I actually was on StubHub. Online in the other room, trying to buy a admit one ticket to the freak show. Oh, okay. no, like, I'm going to the freak oh, show. Oh, no. hey, I want to go there too, man. That is amazing. I've I been mean, there for quite some time. You don't want to. <laughs> it cry. seems like it, it's like <laughs> layers of goodness. Like Joe, a, a, Joe actually lives in the freak show. <laughs> I do live in the freak. <laughs> yes, in Freakville. He is He's the like, mayor. That's me. <laughs> me and my dog. It's <laughs> He's the mayor of Nutville. My dog. My little um, pup. Yeah. I can't forget that. Can't forget it. No. Let me let me dive into the writing of this album. Uh, what's the writing loot, uh, routine like? Is it something that um, you're coming up with a groove, or, or like you're hearing beats, you're feeling words, putting it sometimes the other way around? I mean, um, I think. Everything you're saying, it, it kind of mm-hmm. goes with it. I mean, there's not really a certain way that I write. Mm-hmm. Um, 
I mean, I'm always writing, like, I'm sure, not even that I remember, but I'm sure a, a verse in one of those songs was was pre-written. Like, it's, I mean, it depends. That's the thing. Mm -hmm. Like, Richie, he could send me, he could send me a track and me just get inspired off of it and write right then and there. Right. Or, I mean, yeah. I think it no, all depends. There's, yeah, there's, there's it, no, there's no. It's a real set way because. There's no. It happens where. And you guys are doing a lot of collaborating too, right. which is great. I mean, which yeah, that, it's like, that's got to be ten times better than. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, it just yeah. there is no real kind of default standard way that it works no, out because whether you're work, like the whole like the reason is here. I mean that that is like a true right. weird three way. Yes. Collaboration. Yeah, I mean, in, in the weirdest sense of the word, yeah. a lot of times yeah. I might send Maggie, you know, a, a track, and then, you know, I'll say, we'll start to say, what do you, you know, what do you got, and then we'll start working on it, and. And then we'll we'll basically just tie up the song as she'll start coming up with words, and I say, now we need we need to cut that, it's, we need to do that. That's gonna that's your hook, Maggie. That's really great. Mm -hmm. Now let's tighten. You know, the, you mm -hmm. know, it just. At the end of the day, I feel like it's really about what just what inspires me. Like like we said, there's not a certain a certain way that I go in, and I'm like, all right, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this. It doesn't go that way. Mm -hmm. It's just yeah. I kind of just go with it. It, it goes, and it just right. has a life out. of its own. Exactly, it? yeah. Yeah, because yeah. yeah, like I say, after a certain point, it would. Um, yeah, it does. I mean, believe me, I've played her stuff of my tracks that I might think that she might like. And it she doesn't. She with something? She doesn't. She doesn't. She's not. She doesn't. Not, not doesn't, the sticks, though. Do, well, you're and not I don't, I'm not offended. You know, it's like yeah. we just. And then sometimes, literally, I can do something. We have some new stuff that's already in the can and stuff that kind of happens in the craziest mm -hmm. way of like really the really grain of sand of a seed of an idea right. and then like in two hours we have a full blown track mm -hmm. lyrics and everything and it's bam so yeah, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm I mean sure. it can really it happens that it can happen that fast or something could be drawn out so there is no sure. rules right. there are no rules right it's almost yeah. like you could have something and, and put mega thought into it and be mm -hmm. like you know I'm just not feeling it and it could be something like you're warming up to What's that little riffity diffy that exactly. only have? Uh, I'm like, I love that, mm -hmm. and it can morph into something great. It, totally, and that yeah. happens a lot with her. She'll yeah. put, she comes up with real good hooks and stuff, and mm -hmm. I'm always like, that's it, you know, that's gonna be it right there. That's our hook right there, you know, or that's the the main part, and then we mm -hmm. tidy it up, and she tightens up the lyrics, and she goes off in her little corner and. So well, I'll tell you what. Put I in a corner. My corner. Nobody puts Maggie in a corner. <laughs> Don't do right. it. <laughs> That's it. Let's dive right back no, into wait, the No, wait. No, we're not. We're not diving into there yet. <laughs> you just ran the whole game. You wouldn't stop that mouth from running. I didn't get a chance to ask her anything. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Now, I wanted to see. <laughs> I hear you've been working with a coach. I have a vocal coach. How's mm -hmm. that going? What's that like? It's wonderful. Um... But it's work, though. I mean, it's... Oh, it is. But that's, that's the what... thing. I mean, I, I love what I do, so it's like, it's... I do work, but it's not. Like, I enjoy it. Um, like he said, um, how you guys can tell I've, you know, grown and and at my record sh uh, release show how my whole stage presence and everything has gotten better. I think that, I mean, he's kind of bringing out things in me that I didn't know were there all along, you know what okay. I mean? Um, but yeah, no, he has me doing vocal exercises, um, going through my songs, singing them, uh, working out everything. So yeah, cool. it's great. Cool. Mm -hmm. Very good. All right. Now you, can, now you feel happy. I know. Yeah, you're I, mean, good. I, I want to at least have one question. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's rip this CD, uh, into everybody's face. Literally. Uh, <laughs> I don't want to do that. I want to listen look, to look it. Look at this CD. Boom. Yeah. Right there. One inch from their face. Let them hear it. Real, real Quick. Sure. This one, Magnificent Me, I brought Lauren Hart in mm -hmm. to do some co-writing with us. Very cool. Lauren's because, great Because um, I just thought Maggie could relate to another female writer. You know, she sure. hadn't really written. Um, well, she, she wrote a song with this girl that was on The Voice, but that's another story. We need to go there just yet. But anyway, so I thought bringing in Lauren, who's a real good writer, and we yeah. sat around. She, we had two sessions with her. Yeah, Lauren's awesome. And um, it was cool for Maggie to, to see how another, sorry, another writer... Um, Helps it the process along. I think you learned a lot from mm -hmm. being in a room with Lauren. So did, this one, yeah. this two magnificent me was written by us, myself, Lauren, and and, and Maggie. So which is another great track from Maggie Gabbard called Magnificent Me.
discontinued race line I'm in and out of space time I'm red just like a gold mine And I may just lose my With the edge, magnificent yes, me. How are you? Oh, what? Okay, I just it doesn't sell from you. Well, I'm magnificent. <laughs> oh. Of course, yeah. you are. Joe, magnificent. you're beyond magnificent. I'll get him out of here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you just didn't sell it though. You're like that's magnificent. It, 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 me. Kind of hurt by that, Alice. Uh, well, I'll tell you what. While we're <laughs> listening to that great track, um, Richie and Maggie got set up here to do a live track uh, for us, and I'm telling you what, I'm looking forward to this. Uh, this is a, uh, I've never heard this track before. It's called... Uh, no? I, I don't think I have. No, no. Here's my dad. <coughs> uh, and uh, I believe this song is going to be a free download on your SoundCloud and Reverb Nation page. Yes, that's correct. Super. It, it is as we speak. Mm-hmm. Oh, excellent. Already excellent. There. It is already free. Yeah. So get it while it's hot. Awesome. Mm-hmm. No doubt about it. So I'm looking forward to it. Uh, you want to tell us a little bit about this? Um, this is a song. Um, it actually, after we finished my record um Richie had sent me something and like how we were just talking about how I just like immediately get inspired by something um he had sent me this track and I just loved it and I just wrote right off the bat so this is that awesome so mm-hmm. kick back and listen to a nice live cut here by Maggie Gabbard called Here's My Val to me Keep wondering why these emotions get the best of me Oh And I don't know why all these people trying to mess with me As I sit and compromise I'm doing all that's best for me Oh We just keep on moving Like we going with the way out here trying to prove it Now I don't lend a helping hand Hear me out Here's my vow Promise to never let you down We just keep on moving Like we going with the wind It all goes 
comes back to reason steady trying to break me down But mama, they don't know that I am stronger now Papa, you hear the sounds and you gave me all your strength I'm just trying to make it so they are no longer weak I keep trying and trying, yeah Feeling the weight on me, dying and dying Keep it moving, keep on climbing Till the weight diminishes, then I'm flying Hold it down until I can no longer breathe in breath. Hold it down until I can no longer take a step See into these eyes, now you can't look away They don't know your struggle, they got nothing to say I just keep it pushing like I don't know the way So I keep on my steps, I lead my own way I can do without what you've got to say So we just keep on moving like we going with the wind ay, ay, out here trying to prove it now i don't lend a helping hand hear me out here's my vow promise to never let you down we just keep on moving like we going with the wind yeah So I testify not to fall into quicksand, undefeated land, that's where I stand, marked upon like territory, sacrificial land. Just keep on moving like we going with the wind. Ay, ay, out here trying to prove it. Now nah, I don't lend a helping hand. Hear me out, here's my vow. Promise to never let you down. We just keep on moving like we going with the wind. Yeah. Amazing. How awesome amazing. is that? Yeah, I mean, just amazing. Thank you hear so it right much. in front of you, four feet in front of you, Joe. Um, I, Come on. I, I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I don't know what to call it. Um, you could, it, 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 in your voice when you um accentuate certain words. Mm -hmm. Just a, it's it's not a flutter. It's a. Did we say this last time we talked about an yeah. ism? Is it? Is <laughs> it's it, exactly. I, what it's, it's, it's just. I mean, un, <laughs> unbelievable. I've never heard it from anybody else. Well, I like that. And Thank it's you. it's it's just unbelievable. It's. I appreciate it. Phenomenal, Meg. You, I mean, you, you, so you know what you're doing. No, that was you're just doing such it right, a great so. intimate performance. It's like Joe's us. blushing a little bit. Though. I am. I mean, that's oh just yeah. unbel. <laughs> I, I don't. I, that just that blows me away. That um, I've never heard anybody else do that sound. I you thought it was either. a reaction from the coffee he was drinking. But it's not. It's <laughs> that or it's the heart attack. Whatever's going on right now. <laughs> oh, right, that God. was amazing. No, I'm really saying that's just. A, it just. I can't believe her voice when she does that. It's just cool. Now that's a great track. Great track. And and remember, everybody listening, that is. Available right now on Maggie Gabbard's uh, SoundCloud and Reverb Nation. So please go there and download Just this song because you will not up. only love it, it's you're going to continue to go to the album, the whole nine yards, download it, download it. Download. Did I mention download it? And it'll make you <laughs> blush. It's it will. <laughs> yeah, if not, we'll have a picture of Joe yeah. in the video on our YouTube channel. <laughs> Gushing and blushing. Gushing and blushing. <laughs> Absolutely. She's worth it. Um, <clears throat> do you I'll have, for you, we're, we're going to ask too, uh, any. Uh, any shows coming up? Uh, uh, semi yeah, November. Let's November? shoot for November. Yeah. November. Any, yeah. November. Yeah. Shows coming up? I actually, I'm going to have a show on my birthday, November 10th. Cool. At wow. um, Pianos in Manhattan again. Which is a Monday. Yes. Wait. No, no. I do know that because Veterans <laughs> Day being on the 11th. Like, okay. Uh, cool. Oh, That's right, awesome. right. Yep. She's okay. also doing this cool thing down at the University of Delaware. It's this um, fall fashion event. It's this really big event like... Um, 
I guess it's big in colleges now where they have these um, they're like fashion shows and mm-hmm. um, like a lot of clothing designers and stuff and stores and everybody's out to this thing. Um, they say about 800 people attend this thing. And it's like, great. you know, and they've asked Maggie to perform. So Excellent. that's a great thing, which Definitely. is going to be cool. That's November 22nd mm-hmm. at the University of Delaware. I don't have an exact location yet, but um, it'll be on I'm the sure website. Sure yeah, it'll be yeah, on the website or it'll be there. I'm sure it's going to be um, <clears throat> some you know, big space down right. there. So. Well, uh, we'll give you a little bit of a break and we're going to go right into the CD, if you don't mind. We're going to hear, uh, I believe, track number six. Tell us a little bit about King of Excuses. King of Excuses. It is a song that um, I actually co-wrote with um, RKVC, Rod and Vince. Mm-hmm. And um, they actually pitched me the idea for this. They had, like, I mean, obviously the idea for it. And, I mean, we just went from there and it ended up being really cool, so... Very cool. Here's another great track from Luminosity called King of Excuses. Big game about how you made for love How a man like you's gonna take care of a pretty thing like me I promise you got everything I need But now is not the time Always got a reason why So I read between the lines This is your life King of excuses you are Player gonna cry wolf How many times? I'd be lying if I said I didn't like the cover of this book I'd be lying Why is it now that I'm finding out The page is hid from me Boy, just know that you're not that hard to read the age with maggie gabbard how's everything going good i love that song thank you are you enjoying the interview so far absolutely i have to ask you are you ready for this question i don't know am i so far in your life what is the biggest rock star or in your case i guess diva thing you've Ooh. done so far the diva the diva, yes. Oh, yes. Yes. diva. Yes. um i'd probably say my own record release show okay cool because it was a I the mean, one we just went to? Yes. Yeah. That one. Oh, that was just totally beautiful. That, that, that. 
I think he meant like, you know, one of those... I will oh. not have red M and M's in my oh. room. Oh, yeah. I thought you meant like, like, well, great, I mean, like yeah, yeah, but I mean the that's best. that's that's, yeah, that is, yeah. that's an honesty. That's I mean, an honesty. Yeah, answer. but that doesn't make her much of a diva. That would make well, it is because she told me what color I had to wear for the show. So I guess that's your thing, Adiva. <laughs> I wasn't going to say. Now, that was a very good <laughs> answer. Why didn't you just say yeah. What is the biggest diva thing? That's yeah. cool. I wouldn't have said that. So. <laughs> no, no, that is awesome. That is awesome. <laughs> I got to ask you, because this, I mean, there's multiple tracks that I really love off this uh, release of yours, but uh, what is your favorite track off this album? I know it's so hard to pick. It is. Especially after coming out. Um, what do you seem to always kind of... Hits home. Gravitate or, or, towards. Yeah. yeah. I like um, the reason. I mean, once again, I love all of them, obviously. But the reason is here, just because I don't know. It just has this like sound to it that mm -hmm. I love. It's very like I don't want to say futuristic, but it is, and it just has like a different sound to it. And even, yeah. even even the uh, title, the reason is here. Right. It's just a great title. And They've had some... maybe oh, that kind of says it all right there. Yeah. There's been a little, I mean, sometimes um, references to kind of what she does has been um, future R&B, mm -hmm. pop, like but the word future has popped up a little bit, yeah. which is kind of cool, because when you think about it, it's like, uh, that's... You're that's setting kinda, the pace. You know, right. that's kind of cool, it's like <laughs> future, you know, it's like, it shouldn't sound like it should be her, what she's doing, but maybe a little new new kind of sort of future R&B, mm -hmm. pop, uh, pop R&B, whatever you want to call it. Mm -hmm. um, and I think the reason it's here kind of gives you that sound a little oh, bit yeah. it's like it's got a little bit of tr you know um uh you know trap beat it has in like, it. i feel like it has it's like got, almost it's got it all like yeah. sort of edm keyboards with trap mm -hmm. beat with yeah just all kinds of cool stuff you know, it really does. <laughs> I know no but doubt. sort of r&b and her killer vocal performance on there yes killer so yes yeah and speaking of vocal performance um I mean, let's get back into doing a live. Uh, I think you said you were oh, yeah, able yeah. to do one live? more. Yeah, All of right, course. You guys rock. Um, and I believe we're going to hear the first track off the CD, Shine. Mm -hmm. Tell us a little bit about that. Um, this is a song that I actually did with Tony Reyes again. Mm -hmm. And I, I think this was our first, this was our first song ever recording. Yeah. Yeah. Well. As part of this record. Right. It mm -hmm. was kind of laying around. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But he um, just played played the track for me, and I I was like, oh, I like, like this. Glide, yeah, right. <laughs> this has a nice sound to it. So yeah, um, I was there actually in New Jersey, where he lives, right around here. And mm -hmm. um, yeah, just I that was actually one that I had some lyrics written for it too. I had mm -hmm. I had some and just kind of built on it. But yeah, it turned out cool. I like this one. Very cool. <laughs> we'll kick back and listen to another great live track here by Maggie Gabbard called Shine. And I would prove with them You don't have to see my sin Profess it to myself, my friends Till I feel I start to mend Yeah, help you struggle, find a bend With all the troubles in the world Do you feel me? With all the lies in the world Do you hear me? Growth in its prime So, so divine Spirits in one now is my time Allow me to shine I wanna love, I wanna dig, I wanna grow Yeah, I'll take you anywhere you wanna go Just let me know who won with the flow This place is our home, nobody gotta know I find my way into your soul I hide away, it's safe to ride away Limitless, never gotta stray Cause I'm taking my own way with all the troubles in the world, do you feel me? Yeah. With all the lies in the world, do you hear me? Growth in its prime, so, so divine. Spirits in one, now is my time. Allow me to shine. I The 
others Living life undercover With all the troubles in the world Do you feel me? is amazing thank you and that's exactly what you should do just keep shining because that's what you do well thank that's what you. you do you bring that sunshine i like it so does my little richie <laughs> oh my god yes he does too don't forget about him <laughs> of course not well that part of the show has been brought to you by charlotte's home detailing home and office cleaning and total reorganization free estimates you can reach her at 856-870-9837 all right, Charlotte, let's hear from yeah. Charlotte. Right. She's the affordable sponsors. perfectionist. Uh, yes. Hey, we need That's perfection it. when it comes yes. to that. She is. She's awesome at organizing. Love it. Yes. Love it. She will take care of any and all needs that you could have. So uh, I have a question. Yeah. What is the next big thing on the horizon for Miss Maggie? Mm-hmm. Well, you can expect more music. We're actually um, in the works of figuring out some new music videos. So you can expect that. Um, yeah, just lots of new music, videos, all cool. good stuff. And shows coming up soon. Yes. Yes. Of course. Very good. Like I said, um, November 10th in Manhattan at Pianos, November 22nd, um, the UD Fashion Show, Udell. Yeah. Yes. Very, Very good. I want to see a lot of you, we a lot might, of you around. some new news coming too, but I don't want to say kind of what we were talking about today, our little meeting we had today. Um, I guess we could kind of talk about that a little bit. Of course, we talk can. about it. Can't of really course, we can drop some breaking news here. Breaking news. We had a meeting with this uh, person who, um, this really cool uh, person of doc- interest, doctor lady, okay. who has this um, really cool um, skincare, skincare line. Retailer. It's like I mean, um, yeah, it's basically just I mean skincare for she. What was she saying? Teenagers. Anywhere between like. Fifteen to thirty. Mm-hmm. That's okay. she said thirty today. I was kind of surprised, but yeah, um, but yeah, sh- yeah. That's <laughs> you would be perfect for that. Maggie. You would yeah. be absolutely perfect. Uh, you know, the, they're going to be advertising in Seventeen and Teen Vogue and all these mm-hmm. kind of that's things. That's what she needs. And, and all this stuff, and they mm-hmm. want Maggie to be like the face of that. spokesmodel. Yeah, no doubt so, about it. It's a really cool yeah. company, and it's the product looks great. I know just, it's. They it's gave her a cool. bunch of free stuff today. And free that's always good. great. <laughs> free <laughs> swag <laughs> is good. No, then we're like, oh, <laughs> they were like, we like that. I'll take one of them, one of them, one of them. <laughs> one of each, <laughs> yeah, or two. Well, these are just avenues that that all branch from the tree of goodness. Yeah, we want to we want to try to expand what she's mm-hmm. doing. And of course, this is kind of yeah. cool thing kind of fell in and. She's a dynamite lady, and then so it's, it's mm-hmm. kind of. You I know it kind of like popped out of the blue. It kind of popped out of the blue. It so. did. Sometimes they're the best things, you know. It's, so that's cool. Yeah. Right, right. Uh, also, uh, Joe, we got a, uh, another sponsor. We have to thank. Who's that? You oh. ever hear the term "got milk"? Well, you got ink. Got ink. Yeah. Well, guess what, what? kind of ink? Good tattoo, tattoo ink. Right? I'm yeah. telling yeah. you. All right, man. There we go. Chico's Crow's Nest Tattoos uh, in Wilmington, Delaware, wow. on Grub Road. Yep. Yeah. Awesome. Uh, you could uh, ask for Chico. His number there is 302-475-6805. And Chico looks like a lot like a pirate. He does? Yes. Okay. Yeah, he wear a bandana him? and hold yeah. He's got a dead bird on his shoulder. Yeah. Well, maybe, not exactly. It's not a crow or anything. You have to it's call him Matey, Matey and Pirates of the Caribbean, it was either Keith Richards or him. <laughs> and, and Keith, just because a pe- couple people knew more than him, you know, he kind of won out. That's hey, cool. Out. It's kind of okay. weird that way. All right. Well... 
I'll tell you what, it was great having you. You got to tell us where can we find any and all information. Everything. Everything. Oh, you want it all? <laughs> yes, we want it all. Um, MaggieGabbard.com, Reverb Nation slash Maggie Gabbard Music. Reverb Nation is just Maggie Gabbard. Okay, SoundCloud. SoundCloud.com slash Maggie Gabbard Music. You can find me at Twitter, um, just Maggie Gabbard. Instagram, only one Maggie Gabbard, the number one. Mm, fancy pants. Yeah. Of course. <laughs> Would it be any other number? Get it right. Come on. Awesome. <laughs> yes. Facebook, too. You're on Facebook. Yeah, but, I am. Mag, yeah. Just Maggie Gabbard. Yeah, Maggie Gabbard Music, actually. And that's Maggie Gabbard 1. Oh, Twitter. my God. Richie, then you know it. And, and, and YouTube. Jeez. And if you, if you go to look it up on YouTube, that's Maggie Gabbard. YouTube.com slash Maggie Gabbard Music. And subscribe yes. to her page. Please. Absolutely. Please no subscribe. Doubt, no doubt. Mm -hmm. And run uh, and download uh, the, the free... Record. Uh, yes. Well, the record. Yes. And and honestly, without iTunes. a doubt. And they can get it, a physical copy if they go to CD Baby. So they can definitely, like, if you want, a, if you want a physical copy, just go to CDBaby.com and the search, old schoolers. search Maggie Gabbard and you can buy a CD. Yes. And don't forget to download uh, the free download on SoundCloud. Uh, on Here's my SoundCloud. Vowels. Right. And Reverb Nation page. Right. Just go out Excellent. and get her stuff. Maggie Gabbard. Just get it all, yes. And everything. Mm -hmm. Well, you, you won't be disappointed, right, Joe? No, absolutely not. And Joe, what about our shameless plugs? What? Oh, we got to do ours? All right, yeah, let me see. All right, let's see. You might want to. You can check out uh, The Edge on Reverb Nation, Facebook, SoundCloud. You can see us every Wednesday night, 7 p.m. Eastern Time on phillyrockradio.com. Mm -hmm. Every Thursday evening on digitalrevolutionradio.com. <laughs> and I want you, everybody out there, for any and all your recording needs, please go see our buddy, the fabulous Mr. Joe DeLuca. All right. At me Recording. Joe, give the phone number. Uh, 856-435-4093. And last but not least, our buddies at Three Heads Production, yes. who's filming every show, they're available on YouTube. Check us out. Yep, right. you can always check out the show as many times as you like on our uh, on Three Heads Production. Uh, yeah, on and, website. And just look for The Edge with Joe and Alex Radio Show. That's it. Thank you, guys. We love you. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Yes. Thank you so much. We look Always forward to having you back next season. Thank we'll you. Do this another year, uh, and we're going to ride out with a track here. Uh, tell us a little bit about Rise, which is one of my favorite tracks off. The yeah. Guys, um, <laughs> awesome, dude. I don't know. I think Rise is. Um, I don't know. It's for. I don't know. It's it's special to me in a way, just because I feel like it it leaves everybody with a message. You know what I mean? I mean the name says it all. Rise. Mm -hmm. So it's uplifting. Yep. Yeah. Very good. Mm -hmm. Well, thanks again for listening, everybody. Thank uh, you. Our in-studio guest has been Maggie Gabbard, accompanied by our good friend and her producer, Mr. Richie Rubini. We look forward to seeing you each and every week. Check us out. And here's a great track, once again, off Maggie Gabbard's release, Luminosity, called Rise. Goodbye. Bye-bye. <laughs> Lost in for life, don't do well with lies. Shake it all off and continue to slide. How you feeling inside? Still alive.
turning nights into noises, defeating all of the dark forces. Climb on, even on rocky courses. 